Hello, welcome to Debbie tutorial number four, how to create a subdomain. To create a subdomain, you would need a, a created domain. So we click on domains, we click on list domains. Now we have two domains in, one from my previous work and one from what we just created right now called my works. That was the one we created from the previous tutorial. You click on subdomains and you write the name of your the subdomain you would like it to be. So if the first one says my works, we can say work number one or any desired name. And then you can specify a description, which would be here are my works for today you click on add and that should take to create a list of subdomains on your right hand side let's create another subdomain let's say work number two which is a subdomain function must be subdomain there are a lot of functions but in this tutorial we are creating subdomains so we'll leave it as subdomains and then we can say here are my works for tomorrow then we're gonna click on add we can create a third one and specify a particular image let's say we'll take um, the metallic briefcase work number three and we can say here are my works for yesterday then we will click on add you can always edit a subdomain or a domain by clicking on the edit sign here and you could select, let's select the briefcase for, um, what do you call it, the, the second work. So it's a briefcase, which is a portfolio. We click on update. Okay. And we can go home and see what we've done on the dashboard. So my work is a big domain. And within my work, we have three subdomains. Work number one, work number two, work number three. And as you can see, these subdomains contain nothing because we haven't put anything in them yet there we go thank you for watching tutorial of debbie